All right, I'm in Tuesday's qualifying round in the 2020 Community Cup. I'm in my 77 account, so we got some upper developed clubs here. And um, my goal going in is my my weekend goal is minus 34. Um, my goal right now is to shoot a minus 15 per side, and, and minus 15 is my is where I'm looking to be so that I can set myself up for this. I. I really, this is my target. The minus 34 is what my weekend target is. So what's that minus 17 aside? That is a big, big, big number. So um, minimum minus 14, and I don't want to be in the minimum. I want to be minus 15 is my absolute minimum score so that I can build on that to try and get to this 17. So let's see if we can get it done. So what I did was I practiced, I had two practice rounds yesterday. And I qualified my 99 count this morning. So I it, it doesn't always equate out to what I can do in my upper develops accounts and what I can do on my 99 account. But I do still learn stuff um, in my 99 account that applies to my 77. And some of the stuff applies to the 99, but not as much. So today it's all about I know what club, I know what balls I'm going to bring. I have some basic win stuff on some of the holes. I hit some perfect shots yesterday coming into the cup and I was able to um, kind of tighten up like what my adjustments need to be. And so today it's all about trying to make sure that the club ball selection is absolutely spot on. And I'm really focused today on trying to hit perfect into the cup so that I can use this round to launch me into the opening round to really tighten up my wind numbers and make those wind adjustments. And then in the opening round, I really want to focus on wind because now I've got the minimum stuff down. It, that should be second nature. Now I'm really trying to tighten it up to make those drops to try and get me to minus 17 per side. And I don't really want to hit minus 17 per side. I want to hit minus 18. That way I'm not putting so much pressure on, on one side or the other. When do you need to get started on hole number one? So let's go check out hole number one. We want to get, we want to every stinking hole. We want to, we want to put ourselves in absolutely the best spot to try and pick up a shot. And on these par threes, we, we just need to be spot on. And this first one's super tough because you're so far down the hill that it's hard to make a really big, what is this hole number two? It's hole number two of Eagle Peak. Hole number two, hole number two, hole number two. Come on. All right. I'm doing the ref bump. One per ring. I'm, I'm in, I think I'm in minimum club, but I'm doing a max wind adjustment. One per ring. I don't care where I'm at in my club. It's one per ring, and I'm doing a 30% wind adjustment. Max Maximum right-hand side spin, about a quarter top spin, and trying to just funnel it up to the hole. Hit perfect. Get my hole in one, and let's roll. So I'm bringing, I'm accomplishing this miracle feat with a sniper and a katana. Katana. Da, 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 da. All right, let's get at it. Let's get at it. Hole number one. Let's get the ball rolling. Today's qualifying day. And then after I get done with this, I'm going to go out and practice in my odd odd account. And um, I'm going to just go out and have some fun and, and maybe try some shots, maybe do some look at some hooks or see what, what some of the shots are and just have some fun in my odd odd account today. And then tomorrow I'll qualify it. Katana, I already got everything picked. I got the katana picked. How many times you guys want to make me do this? All right. Maximum. And just a little sliver. Top spin. You want to go right at the cup. So let's make sure I'm going right at the cup. I am. So it's 3 3, 30% wind adjustment. That's going to be a four ring pull. Just trying to hit perfect. Hitting perfect. Let's see if I can get that in the cup. Get in the hole. Get in the hole. Give myself a look at. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, just a bit on the outside. And I was going right at the flagpole. And I think the deal is, is that we need to be on the right hand side of the cup here, or we need to draw just a little teeny bit more. Like, like the point one or point two or just a little teeny bit more if we're going to go right at the flagpole. I kind of like the idea of going at the flagpole and then doing our wind adjustment and then adding on just a little sliver. But sometimes when you're on, 
you know, that was a full, what, three ring or four ring adjustment right there. And when you're trying to add the sliver on, especially on a 100% accurate club, you know, you're trying to get on point one and it end up just this, you know, it might be point three and it might be a little off. So maybe starting off on the right hand side of the cup would be better. But I am right there. And I will tell you that this has not been a, I still haven't hit the hole in one on this this week, but I do believe that this, this shot right here from the rough is definitely the way to go at it. Um, if you're trying to increase your odds of getting hole in one here, and this has not in the past been a traditionally high hole in one hole for me, but I am really liking the looks. I am going to end up with a hole in one on this hole this week. And hopefully, hopefully it's in the weekend round. <laughs> I'd like to get one in the opening round, but I'm, I really like all of those hole in ones. I, you know, if I say, if I go to the weekend round and I don't get a lot of hole in ones until I get to the weekend round, I'll be okay with that. <laughs> But I am right there, right there. And I like those adjustments. So I'm that is a hole right there. We talk I talk about practicing. That is a hole right there. I've literally I've taken that rough bump what four times now? Five times. And that's that's I I never used the rough bump before. I always came at it a different way before. So I've been real close and dialed that in. So that hole is done. I've got my adjustments there. It's just a matter of the fine little tweak on like which which side of the cup you're going to be on. And I think I'm I'm I've got that one dialed in. I've got a hole in one is waiting for me on that hole. So when I talk about notes and the progression of my notes, hole number one, I can put a check mark next to that. That is tight. That is where I need to be right there. All right, that was hole number one of the 2020 Community Cup. In Tuesday's qualifying round in my 77 account. Thanks for watching.